Okay, so basically the aim of this uh, summer school for these kids is basically in one, in one sentence to show them the difference between theory and practice, okay? So what they're doing, as you can see in the, in the shot here, is programming a robot to take, to take the course uh, from, from one to nine. Now I think what, what they don't realise is when they buy an electrical product like a mobile phone or a radio or a TV, it just works out of the box. But the process of, of the design, the engineering, the problems to get to that product right at the end is what they're trying to learn here today because that is actually what um, they, don't, they don't really appreciate. So I think the earlier they learn this, the better. And, and you can see that they, they're starting to get frustrated, which is, a, which is a sign that they're learning something, which is <laughs> quite good. Um, at the moment, we're trying to get a robot to go along a track, which is a specific way. And we're using a program um, which is quite difficult because you need to figure out the measurement of the fat I would say it wouldn't go properly. What, it's not going to go straight, so we've got off track. Well, this is the fourth year that I've worked as a mentor on these summer schools, and I really enjoy helping out the students uh, when they get to do real um, practical experiments that they wouldn't get to do at school in the, in the laboratory series materials. So, it's really great that they get a chance to do that and I can help them out with that and answer any questions they have about coming to university and higher education. My teacher encouraged me to come here because it's a science, engineering, maths and technology summer school and engineering and science isn't like something that we do that much at school compared to like English and maths. Mm. So I thought that doing engineering would be helpful to me and it would give me like an insight and it's a university so it will give me an insight into university life and I want to go into higher education when I leave college so it's given me the experience of college life and university life. Today we was doing chemistry and we was looking at a chemiluminescent reaction where we re reacted the chemicals so that it produces a light without producing any heat energy. The summer schools are a really valuable experience for the students, so when they come to apply to university, it'll hopefully make them stand out from the crowd, they can write about it on their personal statement and discuss it at interviews, and it's just a really, a really good experience for them to have. It gives them an idea of what subjects they might like to study at higher education and um, what the subjects involve and what their job prospects are afterwards.